Hey, what's going on everyone? Uh, with this video, I'm going to do uh, an opening because I don't know why. Um, I just picked up uh, one of the new Disney edition minifigures from um, Lego figures from Tesco. And I only bought the one. Usually, stuff like this, I, I would buy two or three to compare. But I'm going to go with one. And the funny thing is, in, in Tesco's, you have this tendency to, uh, and I know a lot of people do it and admit it, um, feel around the bags because you can kind of tell which figure you have in the packet. And sometimes doing that after a while is kind of embarrassing because then you get strange looks and everything. Anyway, you get the picture. But uh, so I just grabbed a random bag from the display, brought it home. I'm going to just unopen it. Um, and I'm hoping for Scrooge because I have some other Scrooge figures uh, to compare that with, but uh, that's something else I'll delve into. Um, so yeah, let's just get on with it. Talk about a different cut. Uh, I just snipped the top off the bag. So we're gonna have a little unveiling now and find out who we have. I really am hoping for Scrooge. It doesn't look like Scrooge. Is it Scrooge? Remember, bear in mind, I, it blooming well is, isn't it? It bloody, it's Scrooge, oh my goodness. I have Scrooge. This, this is the, mainly the first figure I want. My first choice figure, he has a little lucky dime. So, and I have other Scrooges on standby. Look at that. This is cool. I'm just going to assemble this a minute. And I'm going to display it with the other Scrooges. Because this is cool. I've got another Scrooge. Okay, wow, I just um, assembled Scrooge. I'm really ecstatic. This is like a, like I said, first time lucky. Um, first choice. It's about as good as a Lego version of Scrooge will get. Um, perhaps his walking stick could do with a hand look, be more like a cane. But apart from that, uh, this is quite neat. So, yeah, this is a 1987 Scrooge. Complete with blue attire and everything. This is this is quite cool. Um, there's not really much I could do. You know, it's just a Lego mini figure. There's not much I can ramble on for the next few minutes. But um, let's do some comparisons because I have all my Scrooge figures, including um, an unopened um, Scrooge figure from the new Ducktales animated series. So perhaps uh, we'll delve into that and uh, let's go. So we're back. We've got. All the all my Scrooges on display. Um, Bullyland Scrooge are a little dusty. I'm gonna have to soak him in dentures, denture powder later on. This is the Ducktales uh, animated series Scrooge I was telling you about. This is, um, I'll tell you what. I'm gonna unopen this one later in the video because this I can't think of a better opportunity than to um, do a comparison. There's so much Scrooge in just one camera shot here. Um, my Scrooge also, if we can get to it, came with an extra lucky dime. Perhaps it's a decoy. I think I must have the gift of the gab with minifigures or it's just blowing luck. Like Gladstone Gander kind of luck. There you go. Um, so yeah, let's get an unopened 2017 edition Scrooge from his plastic and cardboard prison. And uh, there you go. Into the scrooge -iverse. Here we go. So here we go, Scrooge is free, and um, I like it, I think maybe the cane could do with being a bit longer, I don't know, but um, colours on this are absolutely sharp, I think the uh, the black outline on the eyes really bring this out, uh, stands very well, I've got to say, proper flat feet there, um, can't pick any fault with this at all, um, I'm still wondering what this might be. Um, now I'm up to date on the current DuckTales series and I can't remember for the life of me what that actually is. So I'm going to need a recap maybe or a maybe I'm forgetting something. But yeah, um, very cool. Um, I'm now going to have to make some space on in my uh, display cabinet and have all the Scrooges together. Um, since I'm handling a camera and handling my the... the all this stuff at the same time, I'm going to have to do all the comparison stuff 
with some um, still shots because it's the only way to do it some justice really like I said I've... so also as well um, the only other drawback with this recent Scrooge um, and immediately I'm going to compare it to Disney Afternoons um, Scrooge which is a very recently released figure as well um, the only drawback with recent Scrooge is that there's uh, not as much articulation um, the arms sort of bend forward and that the legs are kind of more static uh, but like I said what really is good about this Scrooge is that he's not a pain to stand up uh, whereas Disney Afternoon Scrooge sometimes needs his cane to prop him up and as you can immediately see he's got some articulation in those elbows there and uh, the legs move a bit more um, but I also like that this Scrooge has like proper glasses he has more cartoonized glasses it, it works with um, that works with the uh, 2017 style of DuckTales though which kind of pays homage to the old comics so here we go we're gonna do some comparison shots So there you have it, two fantastically good Scrooge acquisitions, one that I've been meaning to uh, unbox for, for weeks, and this uh, very nice turn up of Lego minifigure Scrooge. Uh, like I said, if, um, if you want DuckTales uh, figures, they're up on Amazon America at the moment. I haven't seen any in the UK shops yet, but... Uh, shop around i'm sure disney store and uh other places will be stocking that stuff soon um wow it's pretty cool getting back into the swing of reviewing toys again um i'll have some more cool stuff on show in future videos but until next time have a good one